one of our great firsts uh, was John Thompson at Georgetown. And now one of his players, Patrick Ewing, has been under, as you know, been under consideration to be a head coach in the NBA. You know this as well as I do. Uh, big men usually don't get head coaching jobs because they're not considered intelligent. And that discrimination has been used against Patrick Ewing. In fact, everything about Pat Ewing to make him qualified, he he has to make the Georgetown legacy. Yeah, and he's coached the NBA. He uh, he he's a, he's a great recruiter. Imagine Pat Ewing come to your house to recruit you to play ball. Right. Another thing I like about the John Thompson is not just the guys who are part they also graduated. I, I would meet Georgetown on the road. His guys travel around their blazers and great pants and with a tutor. He may have been the first person to have the tutor on the road, not just not just a trainer. Yeah. Like he their leg trip, but a tutor. Georgetown boys graduated. That's right. That, that's a legacy of John Thompson. He won a championship two years, but, but really making boys real men. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, you all would do me a, a great favor if you go this morning to hirepatrickewing.com, sign the petition for Georgetown University to hire Patrick as head coach of the Hoyas. Go to hirepatrickewing.com um, uh, if you would. Um, Reverend Jackson, on you your... Know, er, 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 earlier this year, they talked about the uh, reparations and some is for slaves yes. uh, helping to build Georgetown. When are you going to have a, a symbolic expression of what happened 200 years ago, have an actual expression of what could happen today. Mm-hmm. Because in the lineage of the, of the slaves, those who've been denied, who are qualified, that's Pat Ewing. 